Hello everyone, this is Anirudh. Today I will show an app which I have created using Power Apps. This app I give it name as a customized Power App Launcher. It will help all the users who use Power Apps in desktop to find the app which is shared with them and launch it. Okay, it is not only launch, there are few information they can see using the Power App. Okay, let me show the demo first. So you can see this is the app. User can see only those apps shared with them. They can search using the name of the app. Let's say you editor, I'm searching. Or they can search the app based on the app owner name also. Okay. The few things are there. First is recent based on the recent app they have access. It will sort it out. If they wanted to change the order, they can change the order ascending or descending, how they access the app. Also, based on the app name, alphabetical order. And if they wanted to change the order, they can change also. Also, if they are using a power app in their mobile and they mark it as a favorite, those app they can see from here directly. So these are the thing. Plus, they can see how many apps are here so basically if someone click on the app name that means all the apps now 83 apps shared to me as as a login person i can see it okay and i'm selecting one of the app the description will appear when i last actually used and when it is created modified who is the owner everything and also the user can click and launch the app this is one of the my favorite app. If you have not downloaded, you can download from this link. I will provide this link in the description box. Basically, this is SVG icons in Office UI fabric icons and Bootstrap awesome icons. Basically, what will happen in Power Apps is you know there are very few icons are there. Correct. If you wanted to get more icons, you can use this app. Using this app, you can get 2200 icons either from Bootstrap, Bootstrap or Office UI. But you cannot directly use, you just need to click and copy the, you need to select one of the icon, code will generate it. You will copy the code and put in a image control image property. Whenever you do, this kind of image will appear. Now, there is already a video also, you can find it and the app you can download from here. If you use wisely, then you can give a good UI uh, in, in the form based application also. Okay. Few other things are there. There. So this is one of my favorite app. So I mark it favorite so that every time I can easily search it. Okay. So these are the things, but I will show you how I have developed this thing. But first of all, I like to tell you why you need it, need this app, because there are so many options to find the app in desktop why we need another app to get all the apps shared with me okay let's go to that uh, slides okay so let's see how many ways we can access power apps from the desktop okay so this is the first option we always use app launcher or wayfill menu let me show it so if you are a regular user of office you always come office.com this is the site type office.com slash apps all the business apps should be appear here the app should appear here but you can see i have 83 apps but it is showing very less ideally what it should happen in all apps you should find all the apps you have access most of the apps are not appear even here if you try to search you cannot find it here okay so this is the one of the problem uh, though it is so what Microsoft is saying Microsoft is saying that if any user launch an app in last seven days they can see there but it is not possible or it is not practical because few of the apps maybe monthly once or bi-weekly someone actually use it so rarely people use every devices second is if you are a owner of an app or you created one app you can see there it is not possible because in in a organization one person develop and used by 1000 people correct so even it will not helpful for those bigger audience 
now admin can also mark a featured app but organization like us where 50 plus apps are there we cannot mark every app as a featured app so that it will appear there okay so these are not that much great option what i found but microsoft also said there is a option if someone not uh, getting that apps there they are asking that this url this is the preview url of make.power apps whenever there are new feature the feature will appear automatically here if you wanted to use in the first hand you can use this url so what microsoft is saying that you need to sync or every user need to sync sync this so that they can see the app in the app launcher but unfortunately uh, i have tried with multiple users i did not get success but yeah maybe you can try it this is one of the option next is let's go through the slide next slide is from the microsoft teams if you are using microsoft teams there is an option so if you go to apps and build with micro build with power platform you can see many of the apps are there but it is not all the apps there there are few apps there but few of the apps is missing so what are the other options so other option is recently microsoft provided one of the um, power app in the microsoft store you can find it so how you go so this is the power apps microsoft store sorry this is the microsoft store where you can search power apps let's do it i have already installed so i get open button but if you did not install you will one get button and you just need to install and give your username and password and you can see all the apps there correct Pretty much the problem not customizable or fixed thing so as a as an admin what i wanted to do so user the description of the app before they use the app they need to say, check the descriptions so if you are aware about power apps power apps have in the inside the setting you can provide the provide the description of a particular app it is very helpful but unfortunately when we use earlier time home.dynamics.com we can see lots of power apps there with the description and filtering option over there but microsoft unfortunately deprecated that feature home.dynamics.com instead of that they have created or introduced office.com slash apps where all the business apps should be appear but unfortunately it is the ui is not same as it was earlier so that is the few of the things i i thought let's go for a customized app another thing i went for customized app because some of the companies uh, they block this microsoft store user not allowed to download any app and install so in that case also you cannot find the power apps you cannot install by yourself of course in those organization i know most of the organization you need to raise a support ticket admin will install in your pc but it will uh, take a time and fine uh, otherwise you can download this app which i have created and use by yourself okay okay let's uh, go to that last slide okay so there is another option though easier access you will click your icon view accounts go here and click on my apps when you click you will find myapps.microsoft.com in this area basically you can find fewer apps which microsoft provided in the cloud okay it is not those app which customized developed and you will find it here so this is also not a option for us so that is the reason i have created an app now let's check the app how i have developed okay so this is the app i have created this is a single screen app i have used one of the connector called power apps for makers to access of this connector you don't need admin admin role or some power platform administrator role just a member can access all the information related to them okay so this is one of the beauty of this connector so this is one of the gallery in this gallery i have called power app maker get apps so all the apps shared with that particular person who actually logged in can see there also in the text, text search apps that is this is the box 
inside the box if you type something it will match either with the display name of the app or the owner display name okay so that's how it is i have used switch case recent app name and my favorite as in the drop down you can see it here so these are the things uh, i have done one of the my in inside the my favorite of course uh, there is a favorite tag you can find it it is a read only property you can find this if this text is exist for any of the app you can uh, you can filter it out okay now one of the uh, thing i have done is how i get the environment name it is not a straightforward because environment name always with the power apps i mean the when you do the get apps you always get that guid of the uh, environment so what i have done basically inside that on start event i have collected all the environment details of the environment inside the details environment i have match with this item whatever the environment name that is the guid that guid i am matching with that collection and getting the display name of the environment that's how i have done rest of the things are pretty simple this is the image inside the image the background image url you will get if you have not download my previous uh, power app admin uh, center app from the github you can download in previous few videos i already shown all these thing so you can find it even the color the color of the background is bit tricky let me show you so it is not that you will get that this this item properties background color and you can di cannot directly assign in the field property why because it is a text so why i need to do is rgba this is basically red green blue and this is the alpha so i need to split take the uh, value and then make this rgba to get the actual color of the background i have used for that particular icon so yeah now whenever someone select this is the one of the area i have uh, taken some uh, level and put all the information one of the thing i i like to talk about that uh, description so you know most of i mean all the apps you can provide the description unfortunately neither app launcher anywhere the description is uh, not visible to the user so i thought it is a very good uh, thing to show user before they launch one app and in the app uh, that app open uri always yes. you will find pretty much for today please let me know if you need any help to install this app thank you